Back to cool shopping can be overwhelming any year. Add in record high inflation and a lot of parents who are much more stressed about it this year. Sina Geber Ab checked in with parents picking up school supplies at the Walmart in Dundalk and talked to them about how they're making it work this year. Woo, budget, budget, budget. That's the name of the game this year for parents trying to handle these high prices, getting their kids ready for school. We definitely had to make an adjustment because some of the stuff is higher, like with the clothes, shoes, and stuff. For Stan Bell, whose kids are entering kindergarten and ninth grade, that means recycling supplies. We're able to carry that over of extra stuff we bought, so that definitely does help out also in the long run. Meanwhile, Sharan Ben noticed her third graders yeah. list is even longer than usual. Our teachers will ask, can you bring in like the, the hand wipes or like the Clorox wipes, um, more hand sanitizer, and then two now as they get older, they have to use electronics. Walmart is touting tech deals on Chromebooks, tablets, and Bluetooth headphones all under $100. And says it's frozen prices on its store brand Pen and Gear. A lot of this is 50 cents, 15 cents. 25 cents, 80 cents. So under a dollar for a lot of this stuff. A lot of this stuff is basically around the same amount you would get it for last year or the year before. And while inflation is making just about everything on your school supply list that much more expensive from glue sticks to technology, even notebooks. Walmart promises the prices for those items here won't break the bank, and parents seem to agree. So I am a cereal shopper. Like, I go to different stores for different sales or for different things, but I generally do come here for the majority. You get better deals here, and you do get better quality products. Good prices. I mean, 50 cents, 25 cents. I'm amazed. And with more parents shopping online, Walmart also has pre-made shopping carts on its website and app with the supplies for each grade from local schools, which Kathy Duncan is relying on this year as the designated shopper for her grandkids. At the very top, it'll tell you exactly what your total is. Third grade supply list for Edgeware Elementary, 8576. And it looks to me like they gave you the best items price wise. Mm -hmm. So if you wanted to shop according to this, you are going to get the best price of everything on here. And since she's done this a few times before, Kathy lent a bit of her expertise. Hand sanitizer. 347, you may be able to find that a little cheaper. I know you can find your Ziplocs a little cheaper. Looking out for these red tags may help. So this was 646, now it's 427. TI calculators from 149 to 119 dollars. Crayons from 44 to 50 cents. And of course, taking advantage of tax-free week. I got to break the news to Sharan, who just moved from Arizona. You have that tax-free week here. Is that something that you're going to be taking the part of? Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah, We've got tax-free week here. And remember, Maryland's tax-free week runs until August 20th. You will be exempt from the state sales tax for certain items of clothing and shoes under $100, plus the first $40 of any backpack you buy. Cena Ever Ab, WJZ. And again, WJZ is your back to school station every day leading up to the start of the school year. We will bring you stories and information that will help you and your family get ready to head back to class. And get everything you need to know on air on WJZ.com and streaming at CBS News Baltimore. I think that one woman should be a personal shopper. She, she knows so where organized. everything is. Yes. <laughs> She's got and the, the prices and everything. Smart of Walmart to make the schools <laughs> have sure. the schools' websites sure. very smart. Mm -hmm.